And I'm in my new place now and I'm still adjusting so it's even weird talking on camera because it's just weird being in here. Um, it's going to be quite an adjustment but this is my new place, my new home. I moved um, two weeks ago, um, finally did it. And it's just like a huge adjustment, but it's definitely for the better. It's definitely for the best. Like, um, we both feel that way, like in our hearts that it was just time, like well overdue time. And I'm just like hoping that, um, that I'm definitely growing as a person and that um, my art's gonna improve and hopefully, and hopefully like, you know, I really believe that I'm going to improve as a person. I'm trying at least, like I'm trying my hardest, like to be strong and to hang in there. You know, everybody's like worried about me right now, which is very sweet. Uh, um, I'm, I'm just trying to take it one day at a time to not like overwhelm myself. Cause, but enough about that, because I'm sure that nobody even knows, like only like family, if any family is even watching this, like knows. Um, what's really going on because I've kept everything very very hush hush like secret but I'll show you my art room um, I love it I have to I'm glad that the walls aren't white thank god for that so there's my art chair and then I just put that light up there and I did that one last week the cat woman I keep my stuff very organized. I'm very clean. I'm very organized. I do not like messes at all. It may not look organized to you, but I'm telling you, like, if you look up close, you can see, like, that I've, like, put everything in the baskets. Like, everything's, like, set in order. And then just the piano. I had to leave my other piano at home, the big one. Obviously, I can't, like, bring it here. And then this is the kids section with their paints, um, their little table. I haven't hung up my stuff, like, I haven't hung that up yet. I just, like, literally am getting settled. And then I have to, like, set up my easel, so that's still on the floor with the kids' books. I have to set that up. I'm thinking, like, I'm going to put it in, like, the corner right here. Uh, so, yeah. I gotta hang that up. I mean, I, I don't know if I'm, some art I'm actually thinking that I'm not gonna hang up because it's kind of dark and depressing and I just want positive things in my life right now. I'm just like, I'm happy that like I have my own space now and it's just weird, I can say that. And I just need like a lot of love and I need a lot of support in my life right now for sure. Um, I definitely need that because I just like, I do get very down and I do get sad and I have like days where I just like start crying and stuff and I like hide it from people like I'm not like really only people that I trust like I show them like that other side of me like that I am like vulnerable that but then other you know other people I just like will smile and just you know kind of like act like nothing's like the matter but everybody's like worrying about me and it's like so sweet I mean it's really sweet but I don't know I'm like trying to like just like be tough be strong and hang in there for my children so and this move could not have been any better I mean it's a perfect time like I feel like this move is like perfect like in my life right now and I'm just like hoping to God that in my future it's just gonna be nothing but like like no drama like I just like I don't want drama in my life I don't want things that don't serve me anymore like people that don't serve me um meaning like if they're condescending or if they make me feel a certain way i kind of like have pushed those people like out of my life like i can't have people like that in my life anymore that like if they're not going to serve me i can't have them in my life and that goes for places as well because a lot of people don't know that like even places don't serve you like if you're going to like certain places like bars clubs you know, and you're drinking, or you could possibly get hurt by somebody, you know, you can never know, you can get in a fight with somebody, or some drama can break out. I mean, like, I'm not, like, even judging people who go to places like that, because I went to places like that, but I'm just saying, like, for me, in my opinion, like, it, those places don't serve me, so I need to, like, kind of, like, push those places aside and not go to those places. Instead, I can go to, like, Barnes & Noble, because... It's like a bookstore and I can read, I can do my homework, that's a place that serves me. Going to the mall, going to the movies, um, church, you know, which I've been going to and I, I'm like so, I, I can't wait to go tomorrow, but 
that's pretty much where I am like right now in my life. Uh, but in the next video, since I'm just ranting and I'm kind of like just telling like what's going on in my life, why I haven't been drawing for like the only few viewers that are watching. I know that I'm not like, I'm not delusional. Like I know that I'm not being followed by a lot of people. The people that are following me, if they're wondering why like I'm not drawing like a whole lot, that's the reason why. It's just, I'm, I, I just moved, so I'm going through like such a huge change. And um, my life is going in a totally different direction. I hope for the best, so. Yeah. Right. I'm seeing my girlfriend, so I'm excited. I gotta get going because she's waiting on me. Uh, she's been my friend forever. I have not seen her though in 10 years, but even if you don't see somebody, it doesn't mean that you don't love them as much. And I'm gonna be late and she's probably gonna be mad at me. Rachel, I love you. I'll see you in a little. Alright, bye.